So I just dropped my 24 to 105 L series lens. Okay, as I just said, I um, I dropped my 24 to 105 L series lens. So I thought I'd put a quick video. I'm just in the middle of moving into the new office, not ready for a studio tour. So I thought I'll have a break, get a quick video out about the importance of using lens filters. Okay. Now what happened is I uh, it was started, started snowing, as you know, uh, England's had a lot of snow, uh, and I went out to photograph some. Um, snowflakes and I thought to myself I'm going to photograph the kids as well at the same time so I have the L series a good old 24 to 105 in my pocket it was in my inside pocket of my coat and as I was photographing the, uh, the, the the snow it slipped out as I bent over to photograph it with the macro lens it slipped out and landed smack right like that but what saved the lens was the filter now I've always said this, when you get a decent lens, a lens that you really love, you always get a lens filter. Now these ones are UV filters. Now I don't buy them to block out UV rays or anything like that. I use them because it goes onto the front of the lens like that, which means that that took the whole brunt of the impact. Instead of the, the glass here, if you see here, instead of the glass, which is the actual lens hitting the floor, it was the lens filter. Now these cost uh, about seventeen pound in the in the UK. I don't know about uh, you know where you're from. You'd have to do some research. But if you look at this, I don't know if you can see it. It is bent. You can see where the where the impact was just here. So it's actually bent. If I get it behind there like that. So that is basically no good. Which leads us on to the next piece, which is Amazon. Amazon is such a, um, a lifesaver. Now I ordered this. I ordered this just after I dropped the L series lens and it came in less than 24 hours. So this is the new filter. Now I there's no way I was going anywhere out of the house without this filter on my lens. Let's see here. There's our new filter. See it? Nice. Now I've already cleaned the lens, I've given it a little bit of a puff from my puffer. I was going to put this back on, let me just show you, I'm going to put this back on. And there you can see, my lens is now protected again, I can now go back out in the snow. And um, I ain't going to worry too much about it. It also helps to uh, protect it from dust as well, which is very nice. Now my, um, my lens cap got a bit battered as well. In fact, you can probably see where the impact was, right there. Okay, it's not focusing very good. Camera's not a lot of good. I am getting going to get a new camera uh, when I moved into the office. So, yeah, I thought I'd just put out this video to say the importance of getting lens filters. Now, whenever you're shopping for a lens, it doesn't matter what shop you go to, online shop, anything. When you click on a lens and you scroll down, there's always a little package option you got where you can get the lens plus a filter always click that one because these filters that can say i mean that's just saved me near enough 600 700 pound just that lens filter 17 pound compared to 700 pound let's say for a new one of these uh, lenses no comparison so i'll just put that out there get the lens filters they are very important for your favorite lenses i'll see you on the next one